Hello and welcome to another update video about FET Fetch AI. So the return of AI coins, let's see. Um, at least we see decent movement, okay? And so far, um, the expectation has been that we bottomed here on the 10th of March and that we are breaking out in a third wave. So if I move up somewhere there, we've got the third wave up there. Yeah. Um, and based on this, um, we did expect, oops, didn't want to copy that in. I don't know where that's from. Um, based on this, we expected here a breakout to the upside. Now we can currently see that obviously we rallied in a wave one of the 10th of March low and that we're coming down in a wave two or we came down in a wave two. We could still reset wave two lower, but for now, because we also, can you see this, this descending wedge that we discussed, I believe in yesterday's video, which had bullish implications because a descending wedge is a bullish pattern. Plus we had the 78.6 retracement and we never saw a sustained break below our support area. So from that point of view, at least there was a good chance that we could rally higher. Yeah, descending wedge is typically a pattern of exhaustion to the downside, which means upside might be coming. I believe we also saw some bullish divergences in yesterday's video or the video the day before we see some decent volume and we broke out. So at the moment, and, and we broke above two moving averages here. So at the moment, the assumption would be that we are now in the yellow third wave. That would be a third wave of a third wave. It's a bit too early to confirm it, but the assumption is there as long as we are holding above the, um, here, the, the last swing low that was formed on Sunday, the 9th, that's at 32.7 cents. Yeah, so what I want to do in this video just to give you a target. So you know about the key level now that needs to hold for this upside continuation. What I also want to highlight to you is the third wave target to the upside that we can be aiming for. Note that this third wave is also most likely not going to happen in a straight line. There will be ups and downs along the way. Target for the third wave would be the 1.618 Fibonacci extension. Can also go higher, but it would be a an ideal target. Come on, it copies in something. Um, 63.8 cents is the ideal target here for the third wave. Now this third wave will subdivide into five waves. So we can add here, five wave move into this. So basically it would look a little bit like five waves up, like one, two, three, four, five. So um, not quite like that, but this third wave would sit somewhere here. And we've got the fourth wave. It all depends a little bit. How is this all subdividing? So obviously this third wave yeah, will have a wave one as well. And this wave one will be a five wave move. And based on Fibonacci extensions, we can also make a, at least an attempt to calculate the length for this small wave one there, which would be the first wave of the third wave. And we're typically aiming for the area around the 61.8 extension. In this case, 44, basically 44 and a half cents or the 78.6 extension here at 47 and a half cents. That's what we would be aiming for, for an ideal first wave of a third wave. So now you should be aware of the key targets to the upside here, the next key targets, Fibonacci targets and key support invalidation points for this scenario. The, the only other thing to mention here is that obviously if we reset wave two and lose support that I mentioned, we're going to reset large wave two, which at the moment bottomed here on the 10th of March, lower. And if we do that, relevant bullish support will be the 17 and a half cent level. That's quite a drop, but only below that level, I would focus really on a bearish scenario. However, the overall bullish case will already get challenged if we drop below this Sunday low that I highlighted, basically below this 32 and a half cent level. Well, that's my update about FET, Fetch AI. I hope you will like the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye.